The door's warded. We'll never get in this way. Damn it. Destroying the Sentinel must have tricked. Cadwell is the oldest of the Soul Shriven. After years of torment, Soul Shriven usually go insane and turn feral. But not Cadwell. He was already insane before he left him. Cadwell sees things as he wishes them to be. To him, cold heart. One fine day in the middle. Hello. Sir Cadwell, yes, indeed, a pleasure. And. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Well, that is inconvenient, isn't it? Rather cautiously, I expect. Watch your step. Hold it. Follow the river. You'll find the door to the Undercroft at the water's end. Once you're inside, stick to the light and you'll find... Best of luck. Do check in now and again, won't you? Cadwell seems to think this Undercroft... Get that door open, the sooner we can get out of here. Well, really? Okay, now I get it. <laughs> You're supposed to like let go at the right time. Could be pretty annoying though.
Oh my god! Prophet's cage should be just ahead. Quickly now, we haven't much time. The only way for a prisoner to leave is for another living soul to take their place. Believe me, I wish there was, but I don't see anyone else here with a beating heart, do you? If Molag Ball isn't stopped, he'll destroy every... Once it's done, get moving. The Prophet will know where to go, but he'll need your eyes and your protection. Remember this feeling. Thank the divines you are safe. There is that at least. They have sacrificed everything that we might go free. I wish that were possible, but I promise you once we escape Cold Harbor, that is the name I have given you. You are but a trace of your former self, a soulless one, an empty vessel that longs to be filled. That is what I've come to be called. My true name is lost even to me. Years of torment have taken their toll. The anchors are Daedric machines of the darkest man. Up the stairs, quickly! We must get to the anchor mooring! That's some story, I guess. Oh shit, okay, okay. Man, you don't want none of this. You don't want none of oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh shit. Can define me. Futile. Soon your world will be in my chains. Come, I will protect you.
I, I just fell off the map. <laughs> this guy's a bunch of health, oh my god. Take that, you faggot. Got another level up too. The dark Angus portal is high above us. I will prepare a spell to lift us to it. But first, you must reattune yourself to Nan in order to regain your physical. A shard of ethereal magicka that carries the essence of Nan. Some link them to Lorcan, the missing god of creation. If you collect and absorb its power, it should restore. Shard of Aetherius, fall upon us now, and anoint us with your blessing. There, quickly, collect the Sky Shard. Great Hakatosh, Dragon God of Time, I require your strength. Let the way be opened, let these wandering souls return home. Let the will of Moloch Val be denied! Hurry! We must go now! That was pretty cool. Message awakens once again. Come here, we must speak. As I feared, we arrived in different locations. I am in a place with the smell of burning ash on a hot wind and the sounds of a distant battle. It matters not, you have awakened once again. Days, weeks, I cannot tell. The voids between worlds disrupted all sense of time and space. I know only. I'm afraid you will have to decide that for yourself. I must focus on searching for a way to repay Lyris's bold sacrifice. I cannot foresee that, not yet. But we will meet again. There is still much we need to accomplish. Be wary, Vestige. Our very plane of existence is in peril. The threat of Molag Wall looms across all Tamriel, and chaos spreads in its shadow.